Hi everybody, today we are going to talk about our Wi-Fi traffic light controller. This traffic light controller has three channels on it. Red, yellow and green. As you see, we type all of them on the board. Yellow is here. And we have ESP8266 chip on it. What we can do here, you can access this Wi-Fi module on any device which have Wi-Fi connection. Like you can use Apple phone or Android phone or tablet <clears throat> or your computer, any browser. That's it. What you need is you just need to type the IP default IP address, which we are going to give you. And... <clears throat> Connect your device to do your production environment. That's it. Easy. So let me show you how we connected our device to our wiring structure. We prefer here number one. We have two different connection style. These are for AC connection, AC voltages. We prefer number one, which red goes to the red slot. And same thing with, for the others. As you see here, the red cable goes to the red bulb, then red slot. Same thing with the yellow, same thing with, with the green one. And the input is 110 voltages. And those are 110 voltages too, by the way. And you can use 240 voltages too. It doesn't matter for 50 hertz or 60 hertz doesn't matter uh, device voltage uh, as long as it is AC voltages greater than 80 volt or 100 volt uh, board is automatically detect the voltages and hertz itself you don't need to do anything so I'm going to connect this device I'm going to plug in this device right now to my AC voltages okay <clears throat> so there is default uh, loop running on my device please remember one high voltage is here you need to be careful too and as you see uh, default one is on my device USA one it goes to the after the red it goes to the green then goes to the yellow then in the loop like that so what uh, now I'm going to show you how we are going to change or program or uh, we call this one normal and there is flash also flashing uh, we will show you all of them right now okay so this is our android tablet after i plug in you are going to see traffic light ap here what you need to do is you just need to click this one and connect that that's it now we are going to open our browser after you open your browser, you just need to dial this IP address, then hit go. Then it is going to ask your username and password. The default one is currently we are using admin12345 and please refer always to the website website where you bought this item, where you buy this item. So this is the settings. We have normal and flush. Normal is the one what you see right now. So uh, as you see, we put one second for the red one, one second for the green one, one second for the yellow one. Let me make this one uh, three seconds here. And I'm not going to touch yellow. And green is going to be three seconds too. Oh, first of all, I need to update this, then update this again. Let me make this one two seconds to see difference between red and green. As you see, this is going to be three seconds. Then it goes to the two seconds, then one second. Three, two, one. So this is normal one. If you want to let's say you don't want to see the yellow one we are going to just remove the yellow from here now only 
it is going to be between red and green perfect so let's say instead of normal we want to make this one flushing let's go to the flush here then what in flush mode only quantity and speed are in use not the time time is only in use on the normal one so i'm going to type how many times red is going to flush five times and one 100 milliseconds pretty fast so hit update look what happened very fast immediate respond and let's let me make this one a little a little bit slower let me make this one 400 update this is what you get perfect so and uh, let's see what we can do let's let me make this one also some flush so if i select flush here let me make this one five times and 200 milliseconds now remember this green section is in the loop always currently we have red and green now i am going to add in my loop this gray section is going to be in my loop with the flushing mode which is yellow yellow is going to flush here see um it is working perfectly fine um i'm not sure what else i can say uh we talk about the ac voltages this is this smd we call this one smd we have emr2 electromagnetic relay that one is working with the dc voltages too uh, the advantages of this one is there is no noise at all on the emr electromagnetic relay and uh, that one is working with the dc voltages but it makes also click noise click noise like tuk, 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 like that if you have any question please ask us uh, where you buy this item and thank you so much for shopping with us and using our product have a nice day